What's going on, brochachos? It's your boy Tanner Wadman, a barbarian body. Today I've got for you a full body home dumbbell workout. We're hitting the upper body, we're hitting the core, and we're going to be getting the lower body as well. Now, we're gonna be going through nine exercises for a designated number of repetitions. I think it's about 20 each. We got a warm up exercise, and for reference, your boy's gonna be using a pair of 30 pound dumbbells. Let's get straight into this thing. All right, we're gonna just kick this off with a slight warm up here. We're gonna be doing about 15 seconds of just some chopping. So you're gonna be bringing those knees up and pumping those arms. Ready? And go. Getting those knees up. They don't need to come up to waist height or anything. Just getting those things moving, landing on the toes, and getting those arms going too. Focusing on breathing, never holding our breath. And the first exercise we're gonna be getting into here are some dumbbell reverse lunges. 20 total repetitions. A few more seconds here. And good. Grabbing the dumbbells. So, we're gonna be getting 10 repetitions on the right leg, 10 on the left. We're gonna start with the right leg. So coming back, bringing the knee down, gently touch the ground. 10 repetitions on the right leg. Ready? And go. Now the further you bring that leg back, the more you're going to be focusing on targeting the glutes of this exercise. The shallower the step, the more you're going to be getting the quad there. Four more. Three. Two. Last one. And good. Switch it up. Three more. Gently touching that knee to the ground. Don't slam it. Last one. And good. Now we're gonna be hitting the deck here. We're gonna be getting some dumbbell hip thrusts. So you're going to, on your back as I said, tossing the dumbbells on the hips. What we're doing here is driving up off of the ground here. Holding those dumbbells in place. We got a total of 20 repetitions. Squeeze the glutes at the peak of the contraction. Ready? And go. That's it. Holding the peak of the contraction for a half of a second there. This is really great for the hamstrings and the glutes. Ten, halfway. Always breathing. Five more. Two. One more. And good. Go to the side. Next exercise we've got are some bicycles. So stay in the exact same position. We'll be targeting the abs here. So you're gonna go from right arm to left leg. Left arm to right leg, slower tempo here, under control, squeeze those abdominal muscles. 20 total repetitions, ready? And go. Eight, nine, 10. We're gonna get 25 because this is a little bit easier than I was imagining. 10 more. Six, five, four, three, two, one more, and good. Coming up. Next exercise we got here are some chest flies. Actually, we're gonna be hitting the ground again. Coming back down, dumbbell on each side. We're gonna be doing flies, but you're just gonna bring your arms down to the floor, gently touching, and then bringing them back up. They'll look something like this. Okay, nice and slowly coming down, and back up. 20 total repetitions, ready, and go. Focusing on squeezing with those pecs as you're bringing the dumbbells up. Ten, halfway. Always 
Just breathe. Two more. Last one. And good. We're coming up now for this one here. Next exercise we've got are some overhead extensions. So you're gonna grab one of the dumbbells. You're gonna place it in your hands as such. If you can see that right there. Bring it over the head. Coming down for a nice stretch, keeping those elbows tight. You don't want them flaring out. And extensions above the head for the triceps. We got 20. Ready? And go. Ten, halfway. Four more. Last one, and good. Next exercise we've got here, some hammer curls. 20 total repetitions. You're gonna be gripping this with a neutral or a hammer grip, the same way you would if you were to be gripping a hammer here. 20 total, ready? And go, just realizing how tough this one here is gonna be. Two. Five, preventing your body from swing as best as possible. 10, halfway. Eight, seven, six, five, push, four, three, two, Last one, and good. Toss us down for a second. We got two more exercises. We got the Arnold presses here. So when you're doing these Arnold presses, we're gonna start with palms facing inwards, and as we're pressing up, rotating the hands towards where your face is in the direction of. So we got 20 total repetitions here. Ready? And go. Five. Eight. Nine. Ten. Halfway. Nine. Eight. Push in here. Five. Four. Three. Two. Last one. And good. Those things down there quickly. Ooh, that one burns. Last exercise we got the upper back. We're going to be getting some dumbbell rows. So you're gonna hinge at the hips here. Nice straight back. We're on about a 45 degree angle. You're gonna bring those dumbbells towards the hips. Focusing on getting a squeeze in the scapula. We're tracking that as hard as possible to maximize the recruitment of the upper back. All right. Last exercise, 20 total repetitions. Ready, and go. Holding for a little under half of a second at the top there as I'm squeezing the scapula together. 10, halfway. Five more. Three, two, one more, and good. Woo! So there you guys go. That's your full body, total body, home dumbbell workout. Congratulations for completing the first round. If you wanna push yourself, go ahead and repeat this workout total two times. If you're really crazy, you really want the gains, then I dare you to try this three total times. And if you do make it two or three times, then be sure to let me know down in the comment section. If you guys enjoyed the video, then also be sure to give this video a like down below, and also be sure to subscribe for weekly workout tips and nutrition tips that you will not want to miss. Thank you so much for joining me, you guys. I'll see you in the next video.